Christmas Lights Boat Parade. My name's Brian Ruth. I'm Marina Manager here at Arrowhead Yacht Club. And my co-host this year is the Grand Lake legend in charge of global sales for Arrowhead boat sales worldwide, Brandon Sharp. Hello everyone and thank you for tuning in to this year's 2020 Christmas Boats Light Parade here on Grand Lake. We are broadcasting from Pebble Beach right here at Arrowhead Yacht Club in Duck Creek, which is the epicenter of everything fun here at Grand Lake, Oklahoma. Tonight's breathtaking event is the result of months of organizational planning and hundreds and hundreds of man hours of people decorating their boats for our enjoyment. We got 33 boats in the parade this year, over 200 participants on those boats, all competing for bragging rights, prize money, but mainly just for the fun of it. The horn has sounded and the 40 foot Christmas tree has been lit at Cherokee Yacht Club, which is the signal of the beginning of the Christmas Lights Boat Parade. So sit back, relax and enjoy the show, which is brought to you in part by REC Electric and Bolt Fiber Optic. The first boat in our lineup tonight is Let It Snow. It's a 1980 Carlscraft 60 footer captained by Brenda Harwood. First mate is Joe Harwood, and they got a posse on board, Leon and Medora Daniels. This is their 14th year in the parade. 3,896 lights, three snowmen, Christmas trees, and snowflakes. This 2007 45 foot formula is captained by Tom McKibben and first mate Tiffany. They have a bunch of guests on board and Tom has been participating in this boat parade for over 20 years. The boat is themed Free Joe Exotic for Christmas and this crew has personally told me that their wish is for Donald Trump in his last act as president is to free Joe Exotic. Boat number three, winter is coming. This dazzling 2009 Four Winds is captained by Dan Frenette. His first mate is Ann Frenette. Guests on board include Greg and Tamara McKillop and Cliff and Randy Wright. This is their very first year in the parade. Over 2,000 lights, blue and white lights with snowflake accents. Been at Grand Lake for three years. Thank you for being a part of the show, Dan Frenette. Real quick, while we got a little lull in the action, let's take a break to remind you folks who made all of this possible tonight. Bolt Fiber Optics is committed to enhancing life here in Northeast Oklahoma. We are investing in your future by building an extensive fiber optic network that currently covers nearly 3,000 miles. Our customers enjoy internet speeds up to one gigabyte along with high definition television and crystal clear telephone service. Take one service or enjoy them all for greater savings. We are proud of our quality products and we know you'll enjoy them too. Bolt distinguishes itself from other providers by installing quality fiber service in your home, farm, or business. Our fiber connection doesn't stop at the curb, and neither does our commitment. Visit boltfiber.com for details. 
Hydra Hoist boat lifts have been making boating easy since 1964. Customers enjoy more time on the water and peace of mind when they are away, knowing their watercraft is protected by Hydro Hoist. Choose America's number one boat lift company, Hydro Hoist, for your boat, PWC, and dock accessory needs. Established in 1947, Cherokee Yacht Club is a legendary facility on the Duck Creek arm of Oklahoma's Grand Lake of the Cherokees. Along with Arrowhead Yacht Club, both give you an experience only possible by being a member of the longest continuously operated yacht club in Oklahoma. For more than six decades, both have been a symbol of excellence in the lakeside private club experience. Cherokee and Arrowhead Yacht Clubs are truly the number one stop on Grand Lake. Come visit us and enjoy all the benefits of being a member. Boat number four is a 1982 Formula 34 footer, captained by Ron Free and first mate Tammy Unruh. Their theme is Icy Christmas Wonderland. Beautiful boat with a whole bunch of beautiful guests. This is their first year participating in the Christmas Lights Boat Parade and welcome aboard Ron Free and Tammy Unruh. Number six in this year's event, a wake and a manger. This 51 foot blue water is captained by none other than Dave Iman, his first mate, Cindy Iman. They got a boatload of guests on board and they have participated in every single parade ever. 31 of them in a row. They have won this event three years, third, the last couple of years. What a beautiful presentation. Thank you, Dave Iman. Boat number seven in this year's parade is the Abominable Snowboat. It's a 2002 Cruisers 36 foot yacht captained by Doug Holman and first mate Colin Kennedy. This is their first year in the Christmas Light Boat Parade and this is a great theme. They have 6,983 lights and more importantly, they have Bumble the Abominable Snowman and the Burl Ives Snowman. Boat number eight in this year's event, Christmas, we are here. A beautiful 1999 Sea Ray 580 SS, captained by Jonathan Knapp, first mate Candace. They have 14 people on board, and this is their very first year participating in this event. 1,800 foot of rope lights. Been here at Grand Lake for 30 years. Thank you, Jonathan Knapp, for your participation. Boat number nine in this year's boat parade is a 43-foot well craft, captained by Jim Lawrence and first mate Jim Holden. Their boat theme is MASH 4077, and it will take you back in time. They have decorated their boat with a helicopter on board and a moonshine steel to bribe the judges for a hopeful victory. This is their second year in the event, and we wish you all the luck in a hopeful victory. Good luck to Jim Lawrence. <laughs> Folks, don't go away. We will be right back with the 2020 Christmas Boats Light Parade. At Northeast Oklahoma Electric Cooperative, safety is the most important part of everything we do. We practice it on the job, we preach it to our employees, and we share it with our communities. We are more than just an electric company, and our members are more than just customers. Together, we are the community. Friends, Neighbors, working to keep you safe. I'm Mike Moody with Prosperity Bank Tulsa. Whether you need a home loan or a commercial line of credit, we can handle it. We make business loans big and small. What can Prosperity do for you? Prosperity Bank, where you find real bankers, not just a bank. The Grand River Dam Authority is Oklahoma's largest public power utility, fully funded by revenues from electric and water sales instead of taxes. Every day, GRDA works to deliver affordable, reliable electricity with a focus on efficiency and a commitment to environmental stewardship. GRDA is also dedicated to economic development by providing resources and supporting economic growth all across Oklahoma. Our employees are our greatest asset in meeting our mission to be an Oklahoma agency of excellence. 
Established in 1947, Cherokee Yacht Club is a legendary facility on the Duck Creek arm of Oklahoma's Grand Lake of the Cherokees. Along with Arrowhead Yacht Club, both give you an experience only possible by being a member of the longest continuously operated yacht club in Oklahoma. For more than six decades, both have been a symbol of excellence in the lakeside private club experience. Cherokee and Arrowhead Yacht Clubs are truly the number one stop on Grand Lake. Come visit us and enjoy all the benefits of being a member. Boat number 10, a 2000 Sea Ray 580, captained by Preston Kelly. First mate is Krista Kelly. Happy Holidays is the theme, and they have a boatload of guests on board. Participants in the parade for three years. They have won all kinds of accolades in those three years. 500 foot of lights, and they have a boatload of characters. Either you have character or you are one. Boat number 11 is a 1988 Chris Craft Catalina 372. Captain and first mate are Mike and Linda Brady and their theme is the joys of Christmas on feeling naughty. They have over 5,000 lights, three snowmen with presents, reindeers and trees, nine foot blow up Santa, 20 foot Christmas tree, and a Grinch peeing out back. Yes, they won second place last year and they are hunting for first. Good luck to you and thanks for participating. Boat number 12, a 2018 Cobalt R35, captained by Joe Potts. First mate is Jennifer Potts. They have a whole neighborhood of guests on board. This is their third year participating in the Grand Lake Christmas Lights Boat Parade. All kinds of lights. Been coming to the lake since the late 50s. Thanks for your participation again this year, Joe Potts. Boat number 13 in this year's parade is a 1998 Sea Ray 400 Sundancer. Captained by Charlie Cox and first mate Jerry Cox, this boat is themed Relax. 2020 is over. And it sure is. And they have hundreds and thousands of LED lights, a giant toilet paper roll, and maybe a Clorox can. This is their third boat parade. And welcome back again to the Cox family. Boat number 14, a 43-foot Cruisers, Inc. Captained by Trey Beard, first mate, Deb Beard. Guests on board, Isaac and Kirsten. First year participants, guys. Hundreds of feet of lights and a ginormous cowboy hat. This is uh, their first year living here at the lake. They live in Ketchum. And check out that fire hose coming out the back with all the colored lights. Boat number 15 is a 2015 Cobalt A40. Captain and first mate is Scotty and Michelle Edwards and their theme is Mr. and Mrs. Claus. They are out of Locust Cove here on Grand Lake and he has been a Grand Laker for over 64 years. Scotty has been a participant in the Grand Lake Boat Lights Parade for years and years. Welcome back, Scotty and Michelle Edwards. Right now, we're gonna take a little break to remind you folks who makes all of this possible from a word with our sponsors. We've been here since 1938, building lines, building relationships. Our employees live here and work here. Our lives are woven into the fabric of Northeast Oklahoma. We show our dedication every day we work hard to provide you the power you need. We work hard to support schools and organizations. For us, this is home. We are Northeast Oklahoma Electric Cooperative. Grand River Dam Authority is Oklahoma's largest public power utility, fully funded by revenues from electric and water sales instead of taxes. Every day, GRDA works to deliver affordable, reliable electricity with a focus on efficiency and a commitment to environmental stewardship. 
GRDA is also dedicated to economic development by providing resources and supporting economic growth all across Oklahoma. Our employees are our greatest asset, meaning our mission to be an Oklahoma agency of excellence. I'm Mike Moody with Prosperity Bank Tulsa. Whether you need a home loan or a commercial line of credit, we can handle it. We make business loans big and small. What can Prosperity do for you? Prosperity Bank, where you find real bankers, not just a bank. Hydra Hoist boat lifts have been making boating easy since 1964. Customers enjoy more time on the water and peace of mind when they are away, knowing their watercraft is protected by Hydro Hoist. Choose America's number one boat lift company, Hydro Hoist, for your boat, PWC, and dock accessory needs. Established in 1947, Cherokee Yacht Club is a legendary facility on the Duck Creek arm of Oklahoma's Grand Lake of the Cherokees. Along with Arrowhead Yacht Club, both give you an experience only possible by being a member of the longest continuously operated yacht club in Oklahoma. For more than six decades, both have been a symbol of excellence in the lakeside private club experience. Cherokee and Arrowhead Yacht Clubs are truly the number one stop on Grand Lake. Come visit us and enjoy all the benefits of being a member. Boat number 16, a 2016 cigarette Huntress. Powered by five Verado 350 outboards, captained by Cooper Edwards, first mate Mary Edwards. Five golden rings. That's the theme of this boat. 200 lights. Wow, what a fantastic vessel. He's definitely winning the drag race. Boat number 17 is a 33-foot Baja, captained by Robbie Brown and first mate Shauna Brown. Their theme is Elfin' Around. This is their sixth year in the boat parade and they have miles of lights. I mean miles of lights. And they want to wish everybody a very Merry Christmas from the Browns. Boat number 18 is a 40-foot Carver, captained by Colin Krauss, first mate Jessica Kraus. Christmas cheer is this year's theme. This is their fourth year participating in the parade. 440 feet of LED lights. They got a blow up Santa and a blow up Clark Griswold. Thanks for making it fun, Colin Kraus. Boat number 19 is Bad Santa's Revenge. This is a 2002 Cruiser's 42 foot yacht Captain by David Russell and first mate Carrie Easton. This is their first year participating in the boat parade and they are a party in bunch. They've got 3,000 lights and most importantly, they've got a bad Santa. Been at Grand Lake for six years and we are excited to have them. Welcome aboard. Thanks for being here, David Russell and Carrie Easton. Boat number 20, a 1996 Carver 44, captained by Tom Comer, first mate Julie Comer. They got 40 people on board. That's right. First year participants, and they like a crowd. They got over 200 foot of lights on their boat, all kinds of Christmas decorations. First time participants, Santa's Little Helpers. Boat number 21 in this year's parade is Merry Christmas and Happy New Year from Joe Gilbert and Carrie Gilbert. They are on board their 2014 Sea Ray 51 footer. This is the fourth year in the parade and they love this event. They do it just for the fun. They have hundreds of feet of light and from Broken Arrow, Oklahoma, welcome back to another event. Joe and Carrie Gilbert, thanks for being here. Boat number 22 is a 2006 Cruisers Express 560. Curtis Tate is the captain, Jamie Tate, first mate. Been participating in this parade for 14 years, over 300 foot of lights, inflatable snowman, inflatable boot, five Christmas trees. That's right, Cowboy Christmas. Thank you, Curtis Tate. Boat number 23 is a Regal Christmas. This 2021 Regal 38 foot Grand Coupe is captained by Jerry Cookson and first mate Lisa. They have three guests on board, Robert Paulson, John Carter, and Josie Wells. 
They have been participating in the Christmas Lights Boat Parade for 27 years. They have a ton of lights. And by the way, if you get by Cedarport Marina, say hello to Jerry and Lisa. Real quick, while we got a little lull in the action, let's take a break to remind you folks who made all of this possible tonight. Are slow internet speeds costing you time and business? It's time to pull the plug on your sluggish internet connection and tap into the power of fiber optic technology. Start enjoying lightning fast speeds with Bolt. Visit boltfiber.com and sign up today. Hydra Hoist Boat Lifts have been making boating easy since 1964. Customers enjoy more time on the water and peace of mind when they are away, knowing their watercraft is protected by Hydro Hoist. Choose America's number one boat lift company, Hydro Hoist, for your boat, PWC, and dock accessory needs. Established in 1947, Cherokee Yacht Club is a legendary facility on the Duck Creek arm of Oklahoma's Grand Lake of the Cherokees. Along with Arrowhead Yacht Club, both give you an experience only possible by being a member of the longest continuously operated yacht club in Oklahoma. For more than six decades, both have been a symbol of excellence in the lakeside private club experience. Cherokee and Arrowhead Yacht Clubs are truly the number one stop on Grand Lake. Come visit us and enjoy all the benefits of being a member. So, Brian, I know both of us got a chance to go walk the docks at Cherokee Yacht Club where everybody gets ready and gets started. And oh my goodness, did all the boats went all out. Unbelievable. I mean, a lot of the things that you see at night are the result of, of lights and the, the reflection off the water. But what a lot of folks don't see are the intricacies and the detail that was taken to put these fine displays together. I mean, it was just amazing. It was, uh, tons of food, tons of laughter, tons of fun. Um, and, and everybody dressed up according yeah, to yeah. their theme. Uh, there were uh, shepherds and sheep. There were uh, <laughs> Santa Clauses and all kinds of elves. And it just, it's a good time. Yeah. For those of you that have never experienced the boat parade in person at Cherokee Yacht Club down at the Courtesy Docks, it is absolutely a must-see. Yeah. Well, the party started this afternoon about 3 o'clock. We had people actually moving their boats in yesterday. Some of these boats that were built uh, won't fit in the dock after they put the decorations on them. So they got to put that structure together, and they go over there and park. And uh, the party the party starts as soon as the, as the boats start getting there. And it is definitely a good vibe. I mean, if, if that doesn't get you thrust into the holiday spirit, nothing will. We got fireworks going off. Those are not part of our display. Those are just other people <laughs> that have, had have tuned it up this afternoon here in Duck Creek. Boat number 25 is a frozen Christmas. 2014 Cruiser's 48 foot Cantius is captained by Greg Crisco and first mate Becky Kiner. They have 15 guests on board from little kid to big kid. They have participated in the boat parade for four years, but it's been 17 years since they last participated. Welcome back to the show. Boat number 27, a 2021 Cobalt R35, captained by Stephen K, first mate, Lana Rhodes. One strand light by the Wallflowers is the theme of this year's boat. On board, Rick Dalton, Cliff Booth, and Marcellus Wallace. Stefan's been in the parade for nine years in a row. Wanted everybody to know he lives in a van down by the river, and he influenced the judging this year by giving everybody his login for Netflix. Boat number 28, Get Hooked on Christmas. This 2017 Express Bay H20 is captained by Gary McDaniels and first mate Jeremy Coker. This is their second year in the Christmas Lights Boat Parade, and they have 60 feet of lights. Get hooked on Christmas, everybody. Welcome back. Boat number 29 is a Formula 252 captained by Kirk Payne. 
first mate, Chrissy Underwood. The theme of this year's boat, baby, it's cold outside. This is the second year for these guys being in the parade. A hundred foot of lights, over 500 individual light bulbs, a blow up snowman, nice presentation on a 25 footer. Boat number 30 is a 1999 G3 Skeeter. Captain is Tyson Tyner and first mate is Brooklyn. Their boat theme is a Merry Christmas from Duck Creek Boat Club in Renault. This is their first year in the boat parade, but they have been Grand Lakers for over 40 years. Beautifully decorated boat with a blow up Santa and reindeer. Boat number 31 is a 1957 Crest Liner Duck Commander. Snoopy and the Red Baron Christmas is the theme of this boat. Captain by Andy Miller, first mate Dalton Miller. Guests on board include James Lawyer and Mags. This is the second year for these uh, guys to enter this boat. Won third place last year. 100 foot of lights. Looks like the Red Baron. Fantastic entry. Thank you, Andy Miller. Boat number 32 is a 2017 Cobalt R5 Surf. Captain by Brandon Perkins and first mate Elizabeth Perkins. Sailing away from 2021 is their theme. And are we so ready to do that? They have over 2,000 lights on board and they've got a Santa. Fourth generation Grand Lakers on board and we are excited to have them in the parade. Boat number 33, a Harris Tritune. Santa Ian is the captain of this vessel and first mate is Elf Tyson. Santa's Ho 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 sleigh is the theme of this boat. Been participating in this parade for so many years we've lost track and over six trillion lights reported on this boat. We also want to let everyone know that no sheep or other farm animals were violated or hurt during the assembly of this float. Boat number 35 in this year's boat parade is a 52 foot harbor master. Captain and first mate is Jimmy and Stephanie Young. And I know every Grand Laker has seen this boat out on the water. It is the big bobber. And their theme is a starry, starry night. They have handmade 20 stars in various sizes from eight feet down to two feet. And if the wind cooperates tonight, you will see a dazzling display of light. Yeah. Oh my goodness, Lake Rockers. Now that was fun. On behalf of Arrowhead Yacht Club, Cherokee Yacht Club, and Arrowhead Boat Sales, thank you for spending your evening with us. We would also like to thank our marquee sponsors for the 31st annual Grand Lake Christmas Lights Boat Parade. REC North Electric Cooperative and Bolt Fiber Optic. And a very merry thank you to the Grand River Dam Authority, Prosperity Bank, Hydro Hoist Boat Lifts, Grand Lake RV, and Safe Harbor Marina. So from all of us here at Arrowhead Yacht Club and Cherokee Yacht Club, we would like to wish you a Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays, and we will see you at the Tulsa Boat Show.